What now then? Maybe Freya ought to have a look at the boy. No, I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Where do we go next? Well, now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel rune to Jotunheim, so we can carve it into that special gateway atop the peak and open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the serpent did mention that the giants had entrusted that secret to Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye, but his hidden boat is very much in reach. The doors are beneath his temple, submerged in the lake for generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Rune of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now, and that vault isn't going anywhere. Seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. Mimir, you were in the middle of a story before. What were you saying about the long war? Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a... ...peace between the gods. Took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy. A certain battle. Anir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people, a selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Must be Govi. Could we? Could we just hold on to it? Maybe we'll find the rest of them. This ah, Fafnir. I always wondered what became of him. Wait, Fafnir? What? Fafnir's storeroom, Fafnir? The very one. <gasps> but Sindri said he was a dwarf. He was. <gasps> now he's a dragon. Funny how life works, isn't it? He's chained up. Perhaps we should keep an eye out for binding signs. He's a poor bastard. Hi, <laughs> lads. before. 
one. They look like they won't reach out of hell. Certain, though I wager his penchant for stealing magical artifacts had something to do with it, must have stolen a trinket from the wrong Vanir goddess. No lad, a lot's changed since we last crossed paths. I had legs. Boy.
go, you wee little bugger. Well, I think Dragon hasn't done much for his personality. 